100 check marks for Miss Katie because she was right. I mean, she's not the only one telling this that it, we can't change overnight. Uh, we need time to change. But her idea is on point because, um, let me explain by using this uh, tree, the, the, the algorithm, let's say, that we start on top and we ask questions. If, it, if the answer is false, we go to, towards the left. If our answer is correct, we go towards the right side. So we start at the top and we ask, our first question is, is veganism healthy? If we answer it in the wrong way, let's say we say we believe that veganism is unhealthy, we fall to, to, to the left, which is false answer. Again, uh, we progress down the tree and we might ask a second question, let's say, is veganism good for the environment? And again, we can answer correctly or uh, falsely. Another question might be, do animals uh, feel pain or do they matter? Uh, or such questions that we will we answer um, from our perspective based on our experiences and in most cases brainwashing by corporations and society uh, which this brainwashing usually tends to be in the false categories because brainwashing by definition means uh, making you believe that is something false not correct so all these pressures from corporations etc people who are trying to make money or control you pushes you towards uh, and have have pushed you uh, over many centuries by by you know especially it's increasing by all this propaganda this mass media and so-called education system that they are just pushing you towards the left the, the false categories but vegan activists are trying to correct this by making you answer those questions in a correct way. And we need to address each question many times, often many times, to make you correct your thinking. You will have many, many, many false ideas embedded in your brain, in your thought processes. All these switches arranged in wrong ways that is that is forming a delusional worldview, and we need to correct each of them uh, so we can at least the majority of them so we can be much closer to veganism and then you will realize that okay uh, after a point you will see how how uh, wrong you are in in your ideas and you will start realizing that okay i have been brainwashed i mean i was assuming this they were telling me this but you know they were advertising on tv that i need milk for my bone health etc and you will realize that that's not true and as you go through if you're an open-minded person if you go through this process eventually you will realize that you know uh, I need to be vegan and that as you, as you just uh, so takes takes lots of clicks switches between those correct and false answers to turn you into a vegan and that's why you need to be patient vegan activists should be patient and also our audiences should, uh, if, if you're listening to this, you need to also realize that it takes uh, many months for you to be vegan. You, but when you go vegan, you wouldn't realize it. You, it will feel like it just happened, like we, like you turn on a, on a switch 
and you turn you became vegan why do you feel that way because if you just had all these um, all the answers correct and just one false you are still not vegan you are very close to it but you are not fully vegan you are you are still consuming animal products and just one more click might turn you into a vegan it, it feels like you you have been like like suddenly turned into vegan but it's not a sudden thing uh, so that's that's the reason why uh, we need to be patient as as activists and also uh, understanding in a way because these people like non-vegans including my my past self was heavily brainwashed and uh, it takes lots of clicks as miss katie said to um, find the truth to get informed to really get educated on veganism and realize that it is the correct uh, choice correct option to uh, get rid of our hypocrisy uh, and to be consistent in our thoughts so thank you very much for listening and uh, please be vegan if you are not yet and i'm telling you this from a point of uh, compassion and truth and uh, watch you know I have some documentaries you can watch Dominion 2018 also the Connections 2021 short documentary one is about animal abuse and why you should go vegan another one is about um, environmental destruction and I think they are quite important also you can just google uh, vegan documentaries and there will be many about health about all kinds of things just binge watch them just watch them all and you will you will uh, hopefully if you have compassion if you're not a psychopath or sociopath i guarantee that you will be vegan if you spend time watching those things and learning about uh, veganism